If may marilini kayong toys, scream or cry, that's because my baby is just by my side while filming this. Mom life is real. Hi everyone, this is Judy and welcome back to my channel. Today's topic is how I introduce solid food to my baby through the baby led winning method. So if you guys are interested, keep on watching. Before we begin, I hope you guys can subscribe here on my channel if you are not yet subscribed and follow me then on my social media accounts. Alright, baby led winning or BLW for short, what is this? Well, this method simply means you're letting your child feed themselves. A great example is you give your baby a banana and let them eat it on their own. Hindi ito yung typical na kailangan pang imash or uh, ipure yung banana at spoon feed sa baby nyo. Hindi siya ganon. Uh, here, uh, in BLW, you promote uh, independency sa ating baby. You trust them that they can eat on their own. But first, um, how will you know if ready na ba si baby for uh, BLW or actually for solid food? Kasi si Mati, we started uh, with solid foods when he turned 6 months. We waited for 6 months. Kasi, uh, di ba, may mga ibang nagsasabi, 4 months, pwede mo nang bigyan yan. Sabaw-sabaw or kanin. Pwede na yan. But our pedia uh, advised us to wait for uh, 6 months. Kasi doon mature na yung digestive system niya. And safe na talaga siya na mag-take ng solid food. So, we waited for him to turn 6 months before kami mag-start sa BLW. And also, another sign of your baby being ready for solid food is he can sit on his own without being supported. Kasi diba, kapag hindi pa siya ready na umupo mag-isa, baka hindi safe na uh, bigyan siya ng food. Uh, natumba-tumba pa siya, maging choking hazard pa to, so dapat nakakaupo na ng maayos ang ating mga babies before siya bigyan ng solid food. And also, ready ready ng ating baby kapag he's really interested sa food. For example, kumakain kayo, uh, he's really into your food, gusto niyang kahablute, naglalaway na siya, wow, okay. Pero yeah, he's really interested sa food and kaya niya nang uh, maglagay ng mga bagay sa kanyang mouth using his hands. So those are some of the signs na ready na for solid food or BLW ang inyong baby. Of course guys, disclaimer lang, I am not a doctor, I am not an expert, I am just a mom na continuously learning uh, about BLW. So if talagang marami kayong questions about this, Please consult an expert or a doctor para masagot kayo ng tama. Alright, well, bakit nga ba baby led winning ang ginamit kong method of introducing solid food to my baby instead of spoon feeding or offering purees? Simply because I really like the idea of my baby being able to explore different kinds of food, different kinds of textures, and I just love watching him do that. I think mas matututo siya sa ganoong paraan kaysa dun sa susubuan ko siya ng um, purees. Kasi day by day, I can see him uh, loving yung texture na ampalaya, loving yung texture ng broccoli, and hindi lang yung texture ng a plain, smooth um, vegetables or fruits. So, I can really see na mas nagiging interesado siya day by day sa different kinds of food through baby led winning. Now we talk about kung ano ano nga ba yung mga pagkain na pwede niyong i-offer kay baby through this method. Actually, any kinds of fruits and vegetables as long as finger size siya. So, you can measure it through your index and middle finger ganyan kahaba kasi yan yung size na kaya nilang i-grasp yung food. And make sure guys na soft enough yung food para sa kanila. So, boil it, a bake or roast it talaga ng maayos and yung measure ng softness niya is kapag pinch mo siya uh, madali mo siyang mapipinch or madali siyang mamamash so dapat ganun siya ka soft now that you know what baby led winning is let me now share the feeling essentials na nakatulong sa amin so far sa baby led winning journey namin 
first muna is yung mga basics talaga na kailangan mo talagang magkaroon kapag nagbibibi na dwining ka. And that is first, a high chair. Of course, you have to have a safe space for your baby to eat. Siyempre, independent siyang kumakain. So, dapat, meron siyang sariling table, meron siyang sariling chair, wherein he can really explore his food. So, very important talaga yung pagkakaroon ng high chair. And for us, we use the Orubel Cocoon High Chair. And we've been loving it so far. Actually, it was a gift from my sister-in-law. And yes, gamit na gamit siya. Second one is a waterproof bib because guys, sobrang messy ng baby led winning. And sabi nga nila, the messier the better kasi mas messy, ibig sabihin mas maraming natutunan yung baby mo. Ibig sabihin mas na-explore niya yung different textures ng food na kinakain niya. We have two kinds of bib. This Marcos and Marcos bib and this long sleeve waterproof bib na nabili ko sa Shopee. Third essential for me is a good suction plate. Importante to guys, kasi kailangan talaga na yung plato ni baby is very firm, yung hindi niya basta-basta matatanggal sa table niya. Kasi alam mo naman ng mga baby, mahilig magtapon niya ng mga bagay-bagay. So kapag yung hindi maganda yung grip ng plato niya, mas mabilis lang niya matatapon yung food. So sayang naman yung pinrepair mo, ba? And then fourth one is utensils. I bought a lot of utensils. I have this Nubi silicone spoon and this Nom Nom utensils and the Grab Ease utensils and last one is the Marcos and Marcos spoon. Bakit ako marami? Kasi gusto ko may reserva ako dahil lagi nang tinatapon lahat every meal. Fourth essential for me is cups for drinking. Ako, I opted for an open cup. Kasi anambang varieties ng uh, baso for babies out there. Merong yung chupon pa, merong straw, uh, and many, many more. Kami, we opted dun sa open cup na kasi I wanted to train him na dun sa real thing. Yung kapag adult na siya, di ba? Open cup naman talaga tayo umiinom. Ayoko na kasing mag-transition pa. Fifth essential for me is a crinkle cutter. Guys, this will save your lives because... Kapag nagpre-prepare ka ng food for baby, di ba syempre finger size yan. Ay may mga fruits and vegetables na madudulas na hindi agad-agad makahawakan ng baby mo. And sometimes naiinis sila eh. Kunyari, mangoes. Pag hinahawakan nila, dumudulas lang. Ayaw na nila kumain. So kapag may crinkle cutter ka, pag kinot mo yung fruit or veggie na yun, meron na agad silang grip dun sa vegetable na yun. The next ones are very optional. Depends on you. Pero ito kasi talaga nakatulong sa akin sa aking BLW journey so far. I bought a food processor. The Biaba Baby Cook. I bought that. Sobrang convenient lang for me na may separate na lutuan yung pagkain ni Mati. Kasi ayokong ginagamit yung mga kaldero namin. Kasi syempre, di ba, maraming oil yun, maraming salt na nang naiiwan doon. Hindi naman nauhugasan ng sobrang ayos yun. So, with the Biaba Baby Cook, dun na ako nag-steam, uh, nagbo-boil, kasi may pasta boiler and then may rice cooker option din yung Biaba. So, sobrang helpful nun for me. Para at least, I am sure na malinis na malinis yung ginagamit kong uh, paglutuan sa food ni Mati. I really love this newbie machine feed bowl din kasi gusto ni Mati yung mga food niya, yung madaling makutsara, madaling mahawakan. So gusto niya yung thick yung consistency and perfect tong gamitin kapag ganun yung gusto niyo. Of course, kapag nasa labas kami, like PD appointments, nag-visit kay Lola and Lola, hindi ko naman madadala lahat ng mga gamit niyang pangkain. So, it's good to have this kind of feeders. I got this from Nubi. Sobrang dali lang lalaga mo lang ng fruits and vegetables and ready ng kumain si baby. And that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching. And let me just tell you guys na whichever method you're going to use for your baby, it's fine if it's tamang kain, if it's spoon feeding, or if it's baby led winning, it's okay because what matters is kung saan kayo comfortable ni baby, yun yung importante. And um, wag na kayo masyadong mag stress kung ano yung dapat gawin. So trust your instinct, alam niyo naman yung best for your baby. And if interested talaga kayo sa baby led winning, 
join Baby Led Winning Philippines sa Facebook because dun talaga ako umaasa. Sobrang daming mommies out there na nagbibigay ng advices, recipes, tips, and comfort na din um, tungkol sa Baby Led Winning. Kaya join Baby Led Winning Philippines. Sobrang helpful. Again, thank you so much for watching and till the next video. Bye!